Hey everybody, Matt Kennedy from Fanfare here in Kalamazoo, Michigan. It's time to check out all the new books that will be coming out this week. Starting off here in Marvel, we're looking at a new issue of Alien. They also have a reprinting of Amazing Fantasy 1000 Spider-Man right there. We have Avengers issue number 61 with some crazy multiverse stuff going on there. And also Miracle Man cover week, so check that out. Captain America Symbol of Truth number 6, Carnage number 7. He's in hell, he's taking stuff out, it's pretty cool. The Marvel Halloween special is out, it is Crypt of Shadows. There are some really cool stories in here, and uh, the art in this one is absolutely stellar. Love it. We have another number one here. This is Deadly Neighborhood Spider-Man. Check that out. We have a paperback for Marvel's Dark Ages up there. Deadly Spider-Man uh, variants. We have Defenders Beyond. We also have a paperback for Banner of War, Hulk vs. Thor. Uh, Illuminati paperback, and an epic collection of old Incredible Hulk stuff. We have new Iron Man issue number 24. Midnight Suns issue number two from the video game tie-in. We also have Miracle Man the Silver Age issue number one. Check it out. No Gaiman. Buckingham art. People are excited. It's going to be cool. Check that out. We got Moon Knight issue number 16. Predator is at issue number three. We have Shang-Chi and the Ten Rings number four. Star Wars Darth Vader number 28. Thor fighting Venom issue number 28 right there. We have a paperback for Trials of X, and to tie that all together, we have X-Force number 33 and X-Men number 16. DC time. What do we got? This is Green Lantern Alliance from in late. It's very cool. We have uh, Aquaman Deep Target up there. We have Batman the Knight number 10 of 10 of 10. That's the finale. Check it out. So another One Bad Day tie-in. This one is Penguin from John Ridley. We also have... Batman Superman World's Finest. The regular cover is right there. Pretty cool. Uh, Black Adam number 5 of 12. Covers on top, of course. Catwoman number 48. Very cool in there. Dark Crisis Young Justice number 5 of 6. DC Vampires All Out War number 4 of 6. We have Deceased War of the Undead Gods number 3 of 6. With the old school Jim Lee style cover. I think it's actually by Jim Lee. And the acetate one, very cool. Duo, Fables, number 156. Flash, number 787. And the Spellspire Chronicles, book one, hardcover up there. Flashpoint Beyond, tying it all together with book six of six. We have GCPD, The Blue Wall, new series there. Beautiful Frank Via cover. Harley Quinn, Legion of Bats, the animated series, a new one for that. We have I Am Batman, number 14. And Marvel Family Comics, Captain Marvel stuff, very cool. We also have Nightwing, number 97, and Refrigerator Full of Heads hardcover, and the new Teen Titans on the bus hardcover. Titans United Blood Pack, number 2 of 6, Aquaman Andromeda, uh, and Rogues, the final issue of that. With a very cool cover up there, and a Wonder Woman George Perez hardcover. Gotta respect it, one of the best ever. Uh, over here for Image Comics, we got Above Snakes, the Boneyard Orchard Mythos 10,000 Black Feathers, number 1. And number two, way to printing of that one. Variant stuff. We have Deadliest Bouquet, number three, Deadly Class, the grand finale issue. The end. It's been a good ride. We have Gunning for Ramirez, Act Two. <laughs> Gunslinger Spawn, that cover's pretty sweet. We have The Marked, uh, new new issues for that. So we also have New Masters, Anita Hawes Nightmare Blog, issue number nine. Uh, Chip Sadarsky's Public Domain issue number five. Radiant Black has a paperback here. I think it's volume number three. Shirtless Bear Fighter number two with that cool Bill Sienkiewicz New Mutant style cover right there. Silver Coin number 15. Fireman Story. Pretty cool. Walking Dead Deluxe number 49. Indie Time. There are a lot, so check it out. Bear with me. I'm going to move a lot of stuff. Alpha Betas. This is a new one from One Shot Comics. Pretty cool. Lots of stuff to choose from here. Over here we have As a Barb number one and two. We also have Castle Full of Blackbirds, issue number two from Magnoliaverse stuff. We have Code 45 and Crashing, number two from IDW Comics. This is Critical Roles, Tales of Alexandria, the Bright Queen, paperback. Frank Frazetta's Death Dealer uh, from Opus Comics. Couldn't tell you what issue it is, but it's right there. Number six, that's some very fine print. <laughs> we have Destiny NY, number one, one shot of some sort. Eve, Children of the Moon, a new series from Eve. We also have Exciting Comics, number 26 right there. Over here we have Back to Fairy Talia and uh, Fear of the Funhouse from Archie Horror. Very cool stuff. Always love that. Flesh Eating Cheerleaders from Outer Space. Yo, that's cool. We also have Forever Forward, a gigantic Frank Frazetta book uh, cover art stuff. Really cool. And um, a variant style cover of it. Awesome. G.I. Joe Real Maker Hero number 299. We have Grim Fairy Tales uh, Horror Pinup Special. We have Heaven's Rejects from Source Point Press. Hellboy in Love, It Better Be Liz Sherman, I swear to God. 
we have horror comics number 14 and 15. Over here we are looking at another, I think this is something's killing the children. House of Slaughter, super wrong. This is number one through number five. Exclusive covers only available in that pack. Very cool. We have Hyper Aware from Source Point Press, one shot. Immortal Red Sonya, I'm Still Alive, a giant hardcover right there. Very cool. Junior High Horror, number one. This is a one shot style thing. We have Mad Balls vs. Garbage Pail Kids, number four. Mindset, very thought provoking series. We have Parasomnia, number three of the new series. Uh, I forget what it's called. Phantasmagoria. We also have Promethe 1313 and Sacrament, book three of five. The Shaolin Cowboy, number six. We have Rising Star, number one. Stuff of Nightmares, the Earl Stein book has a reprinting. This gigantic, super cool book. This is the TMNT Compendium of the Mirage stuff. It collects issues number one through seven, nine through 14, all the little mini stuff, all in reading order. Very cool stuff. Now, what you'd be used to watching TV shows of Turtles. We have uh, Transformers Grimlock, the best stuff with the Biggie cover. Um, this is Travis Cavell. I'm not going to try to pronounce that. I always ruin it. Tough stuff from Source Point Press. We also have Vampirella Strikes. Really cool there. Uh, where everything turned blue. Wind thrown in the sky. Issue number three. Tie that all up. Uh, and a little bit of media. Started with some manga, though, too. Um, it's over here. All right, we got Candy and Cigarettes. Cool. Uh, Persona 5, volume number 9, with the Futaba storyline. I love Futaba. This is super cool. Uh, PTSD Radio from Masaki Nakayama. Awesome stuff. Like little three or four page horror stories. They're really creepy. Awesome legendary writer. Uh, the Shonen Jump Guide to Making Manga. We also have Turning the Tables on the Seatmate Killer. I hope it works. I really do. Uh, right here we have Yozakura Family Mission. Mission Yozakura Family number one. This crazy book, Drip Drip. Nutty cover. It's going to be a cool one. And the Evil, the Evil Secret Society of Cats. Josh's official pick of the week, whether he likes it or not. We have Alien, uh, Only Firefly, with a hardcover Only Firefly. Two issues of Doctor Who magazine, because that's how they do it. Oh, man. My man Victor Crowley from Hatchet, Halloween Tales number four. That's super cool. Night of the Living Dead Revengeance, uh, Predator, Star Wars Darth Vader, Star Wars Darth Vader paperback, and A Stranger Things little paperback. A little bit of kids, a little bit of toys. Not a crazy amount today. Over here we have Bobo and the Pup Pup, Lego Ninjago Garmageddon. That's issue number five. Sonic the Hedgehog, Scrapnik Island. And hey, that's it for kids. Cool, right? So on to some toys. There's some cool to show you. Starting off here with a little bit of pops. We're looking at Valkyrie from Thor Love and Thunder and the Mare in the Blacklight version from there for Christmas. This awesome Secret Wars lunch pail. Cool stuff all on the sides. Super rad thermos. Gotta love it. These mini figures here for Iron Man, Captain America, Firestar, Nova, Spider-Man, and Moon Knight. We have a Nendroid for Optimus Prime himself. Pop-up parade for the Dark Magician Girl from Yu-Gi-Oh. This other girl, Nobara Kugasaki. Uh, this dude right here, Dobby. What's up? I think that's Jujutsu Kaisen. These Crystal Poo Sheens. Very cool stuff. They're so pretty. We also have Superman, DC Comics figure. Very cool. Tons of face, uh, tons of arms, hands. You know, all, you know how figures work. They're all there. We have a Sailor Moon Kuposket as well as a Jujutsu Kaisen Kuposket. We have this little Cell dude from Dragon Ball, as well as Broly. There's Super Saiyan. I think it's Broly. Not sure. And a gigantic Cell. That's incredibly cool. We have these guys over here. It's uh, Gogeta and Super Saiyan Gogeta. Very cool. We also have a Something's Killing the Children official bandana blue. And for variants, this is Alpha Beta's number one, the LRB variant, one in 40. We also have Eve Children Moon at the Del Mundo variant 1 in 50. We have Eve Children Moon number 1 Mercado variant 1 in 25. Miracle Man Buckingham uh, Hidden Gem variant 1 in 50. And Deceased, War of the Undead Gods, Kamenaki variant 1 in 50. Haha, <laughs> there it is. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you have any questions, the number is 269 349 8866. Have a good night.